respect anyone. So, Justice, now let me begin with you on this note that for now, I'm going to blame you. You are responsible for what is happening in Parliament now. Maybe by now, uh, the five attempts by the NPP to have this, uh, it's a, a European, I'll look for it again and give the correct uh, description of uh, what it is that they have been seeking to pass, to help, you know, the economy, and it has been shut down, and other issues too have been shut down five times using this judgment. You have caused this. Amita, um, I, I went into this with that single objective as a patriot to bring all of us together um, and be able to forge ahead as nationals with a single objective of developing this country and protecting the welfare of our people uh, and indeed advancing safety. Um, and indeed, this, possibly the next objective was to ensure that we get that kind of judgment that all of us would embrace without having to target as a political judgment as we've always done in this country. Um, invariably, whatever judgment that would have been obtained if an MPP sponsored candidate, uh, um, a plaintiff or an NDC sponsored um, plaintiff had gone to court, um, most likely would have had that kind of judgment that however good it might be, people will still shoot it down on the basis that it is colored and tainted with politics. And, and for me, this was possibly one of the, the salient objectives for going to the Supreme Court. That because I was not, I'm not linked to any of these political parties. I do not hold any political party card. Um, I am not a member of any of these political parties. I felt um, deeply that, um, particularly also being a lawyer, if I appear before the Supreme Court and obtain a judgment, however unfavorable that judgment might be to myself as a person or to whoever um, who will be um, affected thereby. And indeed, I mean, having said that, I need to point out that indeed all of us are affected equally by this judgment, mm. whether you consider it as a lose or you consider it as a win. Okay. You are affected equally thereby. Um, and because really, it's a judgment that, as you rightly pointed out, NDC and MPP will all use it going forward um, because it becomes a guiding principle for all of us. And so all of us are equally affected. It's not really a loss or a win for justice such a lie. Mm. Now, do you feel, do you feel 